Hello there. My name is Steven Gugu. I work with Invest as a financial modeling trainer. I would like to welcome you to this financial modeling training, which is supposed to help you make better decisions using Excel. Over the next couple of sessions, I would like to do three key things for you. The first thing would be to help you be more efficient when using Excel. I'd like to introduce a few shortcuts for you on Excel and a new methodology in financial modeling called the FAST methodology. All this is aimed at making you flexible, appropriate, structured, and transparent in your financial model. The second thing I'd like to do for you is to refresh your knowledge in finance and accounting. Any financial modeling training is not complete without covering aspects of finance and accounting. We're going to revisit the theory behind aspects like depreciation, working capital, deferred tax, and so forth as we go through this training. This should hopefully remind you what your professor was raving about. The third thing we shall cover is the attitudes you need to have when you're doing your forecast. It is very important as someone who is working with Excel and looking at the future to have clear conceptual model that you later translate into Excel. This calls for a certain level of clarity in terms of future expectations, which then translates to a good financial model. We shall spend time on these aspects. I would like to do those three things, and by the time we are done, if we achieve them, the training will have been a success for both myself and yourself. So who is this course aimed at? This course is relevant for you if you are an investment or financial analyst. You're looking at a project or at a company and you want to figure out what is the value of this company or you want to figure out what is the IRR or the NPV of a project. You want to flex these variables by carrying out sensitivity and scenario analysis. It is relevant for you if you're an accountant. You're preparing a budget and forecast and you want to carry out variance analysis and even analyze the performance of your company. It is also relevant if you're a negotiator. You're negotiating with other parties. The key issue is what pricing you use. How do you apply sensitivity analysis to figure out what is the best price to come in at? At what point will you decide not to get into a transaction? I hope you're going to greatly benefit from the training. You're probably wondering why I'm seated in front of you and training on financial models. I will answer that by giving you my personal philosophy. The best teachers are those who have taken a route, figured out it is the wrong one, and are now on the right route. A short story before I introduce myself. I used to be an analyst in one of the big investment banks in Europe. And I remember presenting a model to the investment committee where I was recommending that we should purchase a particular security. In the middle of the presentation, someone stopped me and tells me, Okay, wait a second. Let's assume that the sales do not grow by that rate. What's going to happen? And so I tell them, easy enough. I change the numbers, my assumptions, and press the refresh key on my keyboard. And the valuation of the company does not change. So I'm there, I'm breaking into a bit of sweat. I look through the model. Everybody is looking at me. It is pin drop silence. I keep looking at the model and can't seem to find out what the problem with the financial model is. After a couple of minutes, people suggest, you know what, why don't you just take some time off and go work on the financial model and present it later. This took a couple of days and of course by this time, I ended up delaying a decision that needed to be made instantly and of course lost a bit of credibility along the way. I had numerous exper experiences of this nature until I encountered the FAST standard, which is the methodology we shall be using in this training. What is FAST? FAST stands for Flexible, Appropriate, Structured and, and Transparent Financial Model. The ethos behind FAST is that any financial model you prepare should not be your financial model. It should be prepared with a user in mind. For a person using your model to review it and to make decisions from that. That's why I like working with FAST. A bit about my background. Over the last 13 years, I've done a number of things, starting with a degree in law, which does not qualify me for financial modeling training. 
but qualifies me to give you a structured approach for building your financial model. I've also done my CPAs, that's my certified public accountant. I've worked as an accountant, and from that I learned a couple of things on the journey of an accountant and using Excel to prepare budgets and prepare uh, variance analysis and so forth. I've worked in finance for the most of my career. I used to head a research team of a big investment bank in Nairobi. And during that time, I got to work on equity securities, bonds, valuing companies, evaluating different investments, and so forth. I also did my CFAs, that's my chartered financial analyst. I've done the first two levels. I still have a retirement plan. I'm going to do the third one during my retirement. In addition to that, I've also done my MBA, which helps me to look at businesses from a strategic perspective to understand how the decision management take affect the performance of the company. Over the last five years, I've been a consultant building financial models for companies and projects. The models are, have helped to figure out how much financing is required for projects, the right mix of debt or equity. They've also been used to value companies and in negotiations with potential investors. I've also trained widely in financial models, in project finance, corporate finance, operations, and so forth. I believe that all this knowledge and experience accumulated over the last 13 years will filter through this training and help you as you build your financial model. I would like to officially welcome you to this financial modeling training and in the next couple of sessions, share with you the do's and don'ts as you work with Excel to build and review financial models. Please join me with your laptops loaded with Excel in the next session as we get started on our journey. Karibu.